You've said today, as you often say, that you live in Singapore. Of what nation are you a citizen? Singapore. Are you a citizen of any other nation? No, Senator. Have you ever applied for Chinese citizenship? Senator, I serve my nation in Singapore. I, no, I, I did not. Do you have a Singaporean passport? Yes, and I served my military for two, two and a half years in Singapore. Do you have any other? Do you have any other passports from any other nations? No, Senator. Your wife is an American citizen. Your children are American citizens. That's have correct. You, have you ever applied for American citizenship? Not, no, not yet. Have you ever been a member of the Chinese Communist Party? Senator, I'm Singaporean. No. Have you ever been associated or affiliated with the Chinese Communist Party? No, Senator. Again, okay. I'm Singaporean. Is TikTok under the influence of the Chinese Communist Party? No, Senator. We are a private business. Okay, so you can see that your parent, ByteDance, is subject to the 2017 national security law, which requires Chinese companies to turn over information to the uh, Chinese government and conceal it from the rest of the world. You can see that, correct? Senator, um, the Chinese That's no business... question. You conceded it early. Any company that does... Any global business that does business in China has to follow their local okay. laws. Isn't it the case that ByteDance also has an internal Chinese Communist Party committee? Uh, like I said, all businesses that operate in China have to follow their local so, law. So your parent company is subject to the national security law that requires it to answer the party. It has its own internal Chinese Communist Party committee. You answer to that parent company, but you expect us to believe that you're not under the influence of the Chinese Communist Party? I understand this concern, Senator, which is why we built okay, Project yes, Texas. Okay, it was yes or no question. Okay. But you used to work for ByteDance, didn't you? You were the CFO for ByteDance? That is correct, Senator. In April 2021, while you were the CFO, the Chinese Communist Party's China in Internet Investment Fund purchased a 1% stake in ByteDance's main Chinese subsidiary, the ByteDance Technology Company. In return for that so-called 1% golden share, the party took one of three board seats at that sub subsidiary company. That's correct, isn't it? It's for the Chinese business. Um, Is that correct? It's for the Chinese that, business, yes. That deal was finalized on April 30th. 2021. Isn't it true that you were appointed the CEO of TikTok the very next day on May 1, 2021? Well, it's a, it's a coincidence. It's a coincidence that it you is. were the CFO, the Senator, that the is. Chinese Communist Party took its golden share in its board seat, and the very next day you were appointed the CEO of TikTok? That's a hell of a coincidence. It, it really is, Senator. <laughs> yeah, it is.